Hey guys, I'm Colwyn. Got a Lego Let's Build here. This is this is Lego City Spaceship and Asteroid Discovery. Hopefully you you saw this in my 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 video where I showed off a bunch of stuff that I bought. We've got this cool spaceship thing on the front here. Nice simple aero design. You know, nice and maneuverable. You know, durable. Got a little mining thing going on here and a little laboratory thing and a little space blobby. It says ages four and up. So I I I don't know. Should, am I old enough to open this up? Probably not. Um, on the back, we've got cool pictures of everything. Uh, there's different stuff here, and let's go ahead. And it's going to be a simpler build with, like, a little pre-molded base thing going on. Oh, and it's got two instruction booklets. So we've got this big plate. That's going to be for a late... Oh. Yes. Okay, so so the first one is to build the spaceship, and then we build the mining station with the platform. So I'm going to go ahead and, and outright split this into two videos. So we're going to put this over here. We're going to put this over there, and that's over there as well. That is trash. Um, booklets. Starting piece. Gotta get that that trash plastic bag ASMR out of the way, right? I'm going to jump ahead a little bit real quick because I'm seeing the pieces right here in front of me. We have torso. We have a head. We have a space helmet, and we have a visor helmet thing. I like the way this looks. That is a nice little figure. He's got some nice back pa painting stuff going on. I like the helmet. The, the visor does not open or close. That's fine. The head itself is nice and simple. Nothing on the back. Nah, this is, this is a good all-around random little background character figure. So we got we got this big thing right here. Let me adjust the camera. Open the book. There's the bag one plus this weird base plate. We have him holding a crystal. I'm gonna go ahead and ignore that step for right now. And oh, okay, so they don't even start us off with the base plate. They start us off with something even more simple than than using big piece of plastic. So I'm gonna put that over there. And we need to grab two of these blue round pieces. They want me to next grab a white one by two right here. Gonna put those together. I like, that is a really nice glittery blue. Ooh, can you see that? That is really nice. I get a kick out of that. And then we need this control panel thing, which designates this whole assembly as the battery package. We've got a battery paint thing here, and then we've got some other information and stuff. I I could outright see me stealing that for one of my own builds. <laughs> uh, at least staking the, uh, the, 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 what's it called, the, the, the top part and using I like that sticker so this is a really old classic piece and this is not quite as old I remember having ones where it's just these studs here but it's like it's it's that's good I like that ah now we get to the big giant part you gotta you gotta see this just, you need see this is this is how I appropriately present the part. This this is how you're supposed to hold it. <laughs> you gotta love the big giant hands, seriously. So we shall we shall appropriately present this part as well. Okay. The joke has now gotten old. We will continue. I've got a one by four stud, but it's got the studs on the side also. That is that we're using it in a spaceship. Ha ha. Oh, 
Oh my goodness. Okay. Oh, okay, so. Red piece here. Tan piece here. Then a couple of these, more of these. Wow. These are one, two by four, but they're got like, mm, thin plate double with the, that is interesting. I really do enjoy that. Mm. Okay. Oh, whoa, whoa. They, 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 they jumped ahead. Wow. The difficulty level just shot up. Let's see, see now, now we've got two pieces at a time. <gasps> wow! That, whoa! Whoa! Dude! Can you dig it? Can you dig it? And I assembled it incorrectly. I, I apparently. Wow, okay. I, I apparently, wow, this is just too advanced for me even. This is... <sighs> so I'm going to take one of these. I think this might be the only one. A little one by two with a stud in the middle. And it's in gold. That's pretty. Ah, see the... Spiked on me again. Now they want three pieces. A couple of one by four black pieces on either side there. <coughs> and then this blue piece in the back right there. These would come in handy for structures. And that's exactly what they're being used for to reinforce the whole cockpit area that's kind of cool uh, see it keeps it keeps jumping up and down the difficulty level man they just can't maintain the same level of of, of I like these I, I've used these on other other models we're gonna go here and here, this is a great use for them to be on either side of where the, the cockpit window is going to go right here in a little bit. I've got these gray pieces here that are going to go with the hooks. Facing towards the pilot, and and this is gonna go right on there, and that's gonna be that. I like that you've got like a whole targeting scope thing to keep them all lined up on course and stuff. And we need to make sure that that control panel isn't gonna come flying off. So we're going to. <clears throat> Yeah, right there. And we're going to help wrap up the cockpit. This uh this is a nice older piece. This is sloped angular piece is really good for doing boats and airplanes and all kinds of stuff. That's that's a fun piece. Okay, so I've got a two by four piece going there and then a couple of these one by two hook pieces <coughs> and they want me to put a couple of slope pieces on top of those white hook pieces Oh, and this is where I get to use the box. I'm going to drop this box piece right into the middle there. And I get to use some more of these 1x2s with the hooks. 
And you know what? I'm going to take my pilot dude. And I'm going to sit my pilot dude right inside there. And I'm going to put this and close that on down. See, there we go. Okay, so I'm going to build this assembly off the side here, actually. So on the last page, they wanted me to take a one by 2 white piece, and now they want me to put those on top, and now I'm going to put that together and put that right there. And now we've got this cool little planetary explorer piece right there. It's going to go right on top here, and I'm pretty sure the little crystal gets dropped inside there. And that's where you store the crystal. I'm going to take this orange piece here, and we're going to stick it on the back here. And then I'm probably going to put this on like that. Yep. Okay, so these we're building, building simultaneously. So we've got these two by four pieces here. Then we've got these orange pieces here and here. And then we've got another orange piece. Okay, and then these are all similar. And they're all going to go on like this. And like this and then I'm gonna put one on one side one on the other side and then this part right here is going to peg right into the back and now we have our finished little space pod scout pod thing and we will go ahead and yes yes yep put the control panel in earlier on I put the cockpit on I put the crystal in the box and there we have him with his his yet to be built other dudes and that is the end of the instructions let me bring over film noir spider-man you can see how big this is next to film noir we've got soda can I've got Scourge, I've got Hubcap, we've got the Cybertronian Car Guys, I like this little build, it was fun, it was enjoyable, I kind of wish I could have more of them because it is a nice sturdy little fighter craft looking thing, there's Hubcap next to him. And um, it's, it's got cool little painted on decals. I could use these on other models very easily. I like how they, uh, these engines, these maneuvering engines can, can be adjusted up and down and slide back and forth. So like if these are both vent ports, these could help to turn really sharp turns and whatnot. The underside's fairly plain, but it's, you know, we're, it's a learn to build set. And overall, it's a nice little model and... I hope you all come back for part number two where we get into the uh, laboratory and, and, and mining assembly thing and um, at the end of that one I'll bring in the Lego comparisons also. So I'm Colin, this has been uh, bag number one of Lego City, Le Lego City Spaceship and Asteroid Discovery. I look forward to seeing you guys in part two. Thank you very much.